And once upon a time, a beautiful baby girl was born. She was such a wonderful gift to the world, but something was wrong. She was born with her organs on the outside of her body. Nobody believed that this girl would live to the age of four. That girl's name is Tristan. That little girl is me. I was born with gastroschisis. I would say it's like when you're born with like your, some of your intestines on the outside of your body, but it's like normally inside your body. I think I have like 50 surgeries so far, probably more than that. Tristan was born with gastroschisis. We didn't think it would be that severe based on our ultrasounds and stuff, but when they went in for her initial surgery, they ended up having to remove all of her small intestine, except for about 10 centimeters. Basically, she eats like a grown adult. She can take in large portions of food, but only intakes about 25% of that. So that's why she has a central line that, that gets her TPNs to nutrients to basically fulfill that need to gain weight and so forth. From a father's perspective, it's hard for me. Um, I'm a big warrior. We have two other children that need, that schedule doesn't stop. And I have to still have to go to work as well, so it's very hard. Really, all you can do is just get as much information and figure out what you think is best at that time and pray that It'll be okay. But as a mom, it, it is very hard to make those choices, as well as how it's gonna affect the rest of our family. Because every time we're in the hospital, it doesn't just affect Tristan, it affects our marriage, it affects our other kids, what their lives look like. The condition that Tristan has is rare. We need resources to do everything that we can to make these rare conditions for kids an obstacle that they can overcome. It's the funding that allows these kids to come to the hospital and achieve not only good health physically, but do everything we can for the emotional and, and mental support and social support that these kids and their families need. At Children's Mercy, we feel like the staff loves Tristan as much as we do, and it definitely makes it a lot more helpful when it comes to being in the hospital. She always to tell me before surgery is anything, I'll be all right, Dad. I'll be all right, Mom. I'm, I'll be fine. And she'll laugh and giggle and then go do her surgery. And, you know, but her every day is a fight for her every day. What I've learned from taking care of Tristan and kids like her is they have a strength and a spirit that is indomitable and that we need to join them not only as physicians and surgeons and, and providers in the hospital but as a community to care for them to support them and to fight alongside them I would simply ask that everyone tonight be a part of that fight let's keep the fight going We've got work to do.